Hi y'all, Alicia here from CKL Farms. And I just wanna give you a really quick video update on the puppies. It has gotten really cold here in Oklahoma. And um, I was gone over the weekend um, up to see my sister for, for a couple days. And while I was gone, it rained really bad here. And so um, Bobby called me and said that where we had the puppies in that little hut had flooded and Harper was trying to move them up on the porch and trying to get them into the house through our doggy door. So that's not gonna happen. So we uh, moved them over to the front porch, or Bobby did. Bobby got them all and he moved them to the front porch. Now our front porch isn't something that I show a lot because it's kind of dirty. Um, we don't hardly ever use our front door. We are back door people and all of our friends and everybody knows to come to the back door or through the garage. Um, so we don't, um, we don't show this a whole lot because it is kind of dirty. I don't keep it up like I should. And also it's set where um, all, everything that blows around here um, blows right up into the front porch. So it's really hard to keep up and I'm not very diligent at it, but this is where we move the puppies because it is a warm, dry place for them. And um, I want to show you how they're doing. See, there's old Harper. Look at them, they're all, they have their eyes open and they're up on their feet. And their ears are open. I don't know if you guys knew this or not, but puppies are born with their eyes, their eyes closed and their ears closed. So they can't see or hear anything. And um, the, at two weeks, they open them up and they start getting up on their feet and moving around like these. Now here's some more over here. I'm gonna show it to you. Like I said, please don't judge my front porch. Hi, puppy. Hi, puppy. How cute. So the puppies are three weeks old. They'll be three weeks exactly tomorrow. And um, as you can see, they're doing great. Um, even after their, their bout with the, the water and the flooding of their little hut, but they're doing great now. So um, I just wanted to give you an update on that. 
And I also want to talk a little bit about um, what's going on in our nation and actually the world with the, um, with the CV. Um, this week is our spring break for school. And it's also supposed to be the um, OYE, which is um, Oklahoma's state livestock show. It's OYE, Oklahoma, or Oklahoma Youth Expo. And it is the largest uh, livestock show in the world. Um, I know that they had like 35, hundred hogs and, that, and that's just the 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 hogs that were going to go there that doesn't count all of the cattle and all of the sheep and all of the goats that the kids were going to show and i totally understand why they would shut it down there were going to be so many people there i mean thousands and thousands literally of people there and I, I really understand why, why you wouldn't want to do that um, in this time right now. It's just that I just really feel sorry for all of the people that have worked so hard and all of the kids that have worked so hard to get, get to that show. They've been working with their animals for sometimes a, a year with the cattle. Um, and they've spent lots of money. And there was also thousands of people besides the kids that have worked really hard to get that show um, underway, to get it organized, to get it going. And all of the parents that have helped the kids. I'm just, so many people have worked so hard and it's kind of sad to me that um, they didn't get to show their, their pigs or their, their livestock animals. And I just want to say that I'm just really sorry. If, if any of you that are involved in that um, are watching this, I just, I want to say that, that I'm really sorry that that's happened. Um, I totally get why it has, and I hope you do too, but I'm sorry. I really am sorry that you are going through that. So, um, I am going to get off of here now and go um, out and see what's going on in the barns. I see a guy has um, pulled up and I'm going to go see what's going on with him. I don't know where he is going. So I'm going to go check it out. So um, I hope that you enjoyed watching this. Um, please if you haven't subscribed please subscribe to my channel if you enjoy it and give me a thumbs up if you uh if you like this channel or you like this video and um, i guess i will see you on the next video so god bless and go pokes